Welcome to Deadly Dames. So it's that time of year again where we're going to start watching loads and loads of Christmas themed horror films. So um, we didn't want to do reviews on every single one of these. So we thought we would show you guys which ones we're going to watch. And you can tell us which ones you would like to do reviews on. So at the top we've got Black Xmas, Black Christmas. So I love Black Christmas, it's on my list every year, so it's definitely, we are definitely 100% going to be watching that, and I actually quite enjoy the, the remake, it's probably a bit of a guilty pleasure that I do like the remake, but yeah, so we're probably going to be watching both of these, uh, and then we have Jack Frost 1 and Jack Frost 2, um, I actually considered them putting these on the, a blast from the past instead of the Christmas watch, but they are Christmas movies, it's been a very, very long time since I've watched both of them. So it's going to be interesting watching them again and seeing if I can remember everything that happened in them. The only thing I really remember from Jack Frost is Shannon Elizabeth and a carrot. That's all I can really remember from the first one. I can't remember anything from the second one, so uh, definitely going to be watching both of these. And then up here we've got Silent Night, Deadly Night. And then I've got the Region 1 double pack with uh, Silent Night, Deadly Night 1 and 2. So I'm obviously going to watch the Arrow, Silent Night, Deadly Night, and then the part two on this double feature. I've never seen part two, so it could be quite fun to watch and review that one. And then Krampus, which is more of a, a kind of horror comedy, but it's definitely going to be on my to-be-watch now for Christmas time. Another one which I've actually never seen, and that's Don't Open Till Christmas, and I haven't watched All Through the House yet either. And then Christmas Evil. And then, I don't really need to say anything about this one because it's probably on everybody's Christmas list and that is Gremlins, so that is 100% going to be watched. Now, as I said, we don't we don't want to bore the life out of you by doing a review on every single one of these because there are movies there that quite a lot of people have probably talked about, like Krampus and, and Gremlins, so um, we thought we would just sort of show you what we're going to watch. Firstly, ask if there's any other... Christmas horror ones like these out there that I've missed because uh, I'd probably give them a go so if I have missed any of them leave comments below and let me know and I can try and pick them up and watch them as well uh, and secondly ask you guys um, if there's any in this little pile here that you would like us to review so yeah that's uh, all the Christmas horror ones that I can find I've probably missed some but it's all I can really find that are like 100% Christmas horror ones there are ones that are set with like snow themed backgrounds like dead snow and and the shining and stuff like that they do feel kind of Christmassy but technically they're not really like Christmas horrors so that's why we didn't put them on this list but here we are quick overview again of which ones we're going to be watching please just leave us some comments and let us know which ones you want us to review and as I said if there's any there that I've missed that you would recommend putting on my, my Christmas horror list then um, just leave the comments and I'll, I'll go check them out as well Thank you very much for watching and for taking part in choosing our reviews. And uh, please like and subscribe. Take care.